It is with great pride and joy that I welcome you all here to Manila. To my fellow Filipinos, let us extend to our visitors the hospitality that we are known for, the same warmth that we shared nearly three decades ago when the Philippines first hosted the World Skills ASEAN in 1996. Almost 30 years on, this competition has grown, and today we witness significant milestones. With 259 contestants competing in 32 skill areas across six major sectors, this is the largest World Skills ASEAN competition to date. We are also honored. We are also honored to welcome Timor Leste as they take part for the very first time in this competition. Their participation reminds us that inclusivity makes ASEAN stronger and brings our nations closer together. As a gateway for learning, collaboration, and cultural exchange, the World Skills ASEAN serves as a stage where young people push their limits, competing not only for medals, but for the pride of their nations. For our participants, the rewards go far beyond gold, silver, or bronze. Here, you show that you can thrive under pressure, where challenges spark creativity, build confidence. And these are the qualities that will serve you long after this competition will end. Your medals may shine today, but it is your skills that will shape your future, serve your country, and help build a more united ASEAN community. As we begin the World Skills ASEAN Manila 2025, let us move forward with pride, with passion, and with purpose. Welcome to the Philippines. This is the second time that we're hosting, but after almost 30 years. Um, World Skills ASEAN is the uh, Olympics of Skills for the ASEAN region. It happens every two years. Um, this year, the Philippines is hosting over a thousand delegates, experts, and competitors from all over ASEAN have come uh, to see what kind of skills um, competition and who will. Uh, go home with the, with the medals yeah, and be declared the best in their uh, sectors. Yeah. No, um, and today, obviously, the, the president is coming to help open um, World Skills ASEAN 2025, which will be in uh, World Trade Center uh, from the 26th to the 28th of this week. Um, uh, World Skills ASEAN is uh, as I said, the Olympics of skills, where um, competitors from all over different countries compete against each other to showcase the capacities in technical vocational education and skills um, that they have so as they compete for the gold. So we obviously have a, a yearly selection as to the uh, competitors from all over the country um, so that the best Philippine um, uh, trainees and the best uh, Filipinos from all over the Philippines can come to first the Philippine uh, National Skills Competitions and then they represent us at the World Skills, whether it is in ASEAN or World Skills Global, you know, that, that includes everybody else. 
uh, even outside ASEAN. Um, what we do is really to try to compete to make sure that our standards are uh, matched globally and are globally competitive um, to ensure that we have the right training, uh, the right standards, and even in emerging um, skills that uh, may not have been there before. So in this week, we will be competing in 32 skill areas that range from you know, culinary, uh, uh, servicing, no? restaurant servicing, all the way to um, hairstyling, to plumbing, wiring, to advanced mechatronics, uh, cybersecurity, 3D animation design, uh, 2D graphic design, right? To show the entire range of the kind of sectors in many ways that uh, technical and technical and vocational education now needs to cover. Ito po ang ikalawang uh, World Skills ASEAN na uh, uh, nandito sa Manila. Sana naman bumisita kayo sa 26 to 28 at makita ang pinakamagaling at pinakamahusay na mga TechVoc estudyante sa buong ASEAN. Nandito po sila at makita rin natin kung anuman ang ating iniisip na, na pathway, no? na karera, na, na trabaho. Makikita ho natin dito ang mga husay at galing ng buong ASEAN. Kaya dumalo na ho kayo sa 26 to 28 sa World Trade Center.